Hi friends. <clears throat> In the last session, we have started that input and output statements concept, right? So in that we have observed that first input statements. Okay. How to read dynamic data from the keyboard. Okay. How to read dynamic data from the keyboard by using input statement, right? So, but Python 3 and Python 2 both are having two different functions. Python 2 is having raw input function and Python 3 has having input function. Okay. Raw input function is available only in Python 2, but in not in Python 3. Just raw input function is renamed as input function in Python 3. So raw input function is not available in Python 3. <coughs> okay. So we observed that uh, some of the examples how to read data from the keyboard and how we can convert to other types. And we observed how to add two numbers and if we converting what type of error we observed we observed all the cases right so <clears throat> today we are going to explain about the same concept but i want to read multiple uh, values from the keyboard okay today my focus is on i want to read i want to read multiple values okay multiple values from the keyboard Okay. I want to read multiple values from the keyboard and uh, I want to add and uh, print uh, sum of that numbers. Okay. I want to read multiple values from the keyboard and uh, print uh, sum of that numbers. Okay. How we can do? Observe now. First, uh, I am taking here and what I'm doing, I'm reading the data from the keyboard. S is equal to input of <coughs> input of enter enter values. Okay. How many values? Enter values by using space. Okay. Enter values by using space. Okay. Because my my requirement is here, I want to read multiple values from the keyboard. So if you are giving multiple values, there should be some separator between every value so that I can separate. Okay, that's why I'm asking enter values by using space. Okay, if we give space so that I can split. Okay, I can split. <coughs> now next what I'm doing is S is equal to Okay, S is equal to S dot split. Okay, S is equal to S dot split. When I'm splitting here, values are there in the form of a string. Okay, values are there in the form of string and separated by space. Okay, S dot split means suppose 10 space 20 is there. Okay, now here two strings you will get. Okay, in that case, observe here what I am doing. Print, print, I am printing S. Okay, now I'm printing S. Okay, don't get confused. I will explain here S is equal to S dot split. I will explain this line one more time. But my question is when, okay, reading multiple values from the keyboard by using space and you are splitting, okay, splitting by space. When it is having, you are printing. Suppose if I, if I want to Add that to two numbers means how? Okay. First, up to now, observe this one. What happens? Okay. Up to now, observe what happens. See here. First, what I am doing is. First, let me run the program. Python. Test dot py. Okay. Here it is asking enter values by using space. Okay, I'm giving 10 space 20. 10 space 20 I'm giving. Okay, now it is converting into converting into list by using space. Okay, let me print the information also here so that you will get clarity. Given string. <coughs> given string given string given string after splitting <coughs> okay 
after splitting after splitting now observe what i'm do what i'm doing 10 space 20 i'm giving a okay, 10 space 20 i'm giving now what i have given 10 space 20 okay after splitting it is converting into list okay what it is doing after converting it is uh, splitting it is converting into list by using two values okay here what i am doing is now anyway here two values are there so i am doing that a comma b a comma b is equal to s okay a comma b equal to s i am just i am writing this line okay a comma b is equal to s means uh, now s is having how many values two values okay s is having two values one is a uh, 10 comma 20 okay now s is having two values one is 10 comma 20 now here what happening is Here, what happening is by using this, uh, when I'm writing a comma b equal to s means uh, first uh, a a a value will be 10, okay? A value will be 10 and uh, b value will be 20, okay? The meaning of this one is the meaning of this one is a comma b is equal to s means uh, 10 comma 20 is there means uh, now a is pointing to this value and b is pointing to this value okay now a is pointing to this value and b is pointing to 20 okay observe now observe now now i am printing the value of a and b the value of a the value of a now I am doing the same thing for B also. B, the value of P. Now observe here. It is asking enter values by using space. Okay, 10 space 20. Okay, 10 space 20. Now it is given string i have given 10 space 20 after splitting it is converting into list okay now it is saying that a value 10 and b value 20 okay now i anyway my requirement almost completed i want to read multiple values from the keyboard now want to print some of that two numbers okay i want to print some of that two numbers okay now what i am doing <coughs> print sum of two numbers Okay, sum of two numbers sum of two numbers sum of two numbers is a plus b okay, a plus b okay now what is the sum 10 plus 20 okay 10 plus 20 30 if you are thinking 10 plus 20 is 30 absolutely you are wrong okay I hope you know the reason because in the previous session I have explained when I am adding two numbers the same concept I am doing now because see first observe the output anyway uh, see my intention is you I, no, no, so, sorry not my intention your intention will be 10 plus 20 means 30 it should give but I am saying that it should not give 10 plus 20 30 it will give 10 20 observe 10 space 20 okay if you observe here sum of two numbers means it is not adding it is uh, <coughs> just uh, concatenating it is adding two strings okay because you are reading the data in the form of string okay you are converting 
I mean, you are splitting that string, but nowhere you are converting your uh, string to integer. Okay, nowhere you are converting your string to integer. That's why here we are observing that 10, 20. Okay, now if I want to convert string to integer means we have to typecast that a and value of b. Okay, then only we can get the value of two numbers. So I am converting here. Okay, I am converting here int of a comma int of b okay int of a comma int of b okay now 100 percent pakka we are going to get output as 30 okay 10 space 20 10 space 20 okay we are getting 30 or not okay here i want to explain Two minutes about this program first before i am not typecasting a plus b means it is giving what answer 10 20 okay when i am not typecasting it is giving answer 10 20 but when i am typecasting it is converting a and b a and b and it is giving sum of two numbers okay some of the people's having doubt so how can you typecast here okay how can you typecast here when you are adding the numbers okay there is no any restriction there is no any mandatory rules so wherever you want you can convert your information to your required format okay wherever you want you can convert your information to a required format there is no any rules or any restriction okay if you are converting here also it's not a problem okay if you are converting here it's not a problem okay case number one case number one case number one here output next suppose here i am not doing typecasting okay here i am noting i am not doing typecasting here I'm doing typecasting okay here I'm doing typecasting int of b okay now observe here here I'm doing typecasting in this case also we will get the same output okay where int of a cannot assign to function call okay 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 it is getting becoming a another function okay once you got the value we have to convert here okay a equals to int of a b is equal to int of b int of b now observe here 10 space 20 if you observe here where i am doing typecasting after receiving the value here i am doing the typecasting okay in this case also i am getting the same output okay programs means uh, we will write in this way only by seeing that uh, big code means uh, how you are writing this many pro this much code means uh, you observed right i am not i didn't do anything just uh, I'm elaborating every line okay now I want to explain one thing reading value okay reading first string okay what string you are reading 10 20 you are reading okay now after that you are printing that you are given string you are splitting okay whenever you are splitting the string is converted into in this way but here already s is there but how can you reassign the same same information okay make sure whenever you are reading this information first it is having 10 space 20 s is equal to having 10 space 20 so pvm or python always going to evaluate the first expression right side okay first it is going to evaluate the right side expression after 
evaluating the expression now it is going to assign the information to the left side so in that way it is splitting and it is converting into 10 space 20 okay 10 space 20 now it is storing into s value okay don't think that don't compare your mathematics skills here so mathematics and the program somewhat difference okay i know in mathematics you will not write in this way you will take another variable but in programming first the right side expression evaluates okay first after evaluating the right side expression so next uh, that information will be stored into the left side but if you observe here anyway it is reading but after splitting this this string never be there okay after you are splitting this string is converted into 1020 before to that this is the string after splitting this string will be there but on the same variable observe here same variable i am printing here okay in that way the things are happening okay here also a comma b is equal to s means already value a is there now here right side expression is evaluating i mean string is converting into int okay the value a is 10 in the form of string okay the value of a is in the form of string so i'm type casting okay after type casting it it is converting into a okay once it is converting into a it the value will be in the form of int only okay in the same way b also now i'm printing the value of a and b and i'm printing the value of sum of two numbers clear right okay see programs means we will write in this way only by seeing 100 lines 1000 lines means based on your expression evaluating the lines will get increase that's it there is no anything rocket science in the code okay mm, let me keep here case three what i am doing here without a type casting okay now i have taken two cases case one case two and case three in this way we, we are writing the programs actually there is no anything other than this okay thanks right so if you are watching for the channel for first time please subscribe to my channel if you are having any questions or queries please post your query in the comment section or reach out to my email id in the given description okay thank you